Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another P.O. Box opening video for you and I have a few bits and pieces that I bought from the shops and lots of letters that have come in the mail over the last few months. Now this one here is actually a beautiful box from um, the Black Milk Project and I will put a link in the description box below but as you can see it's wrapped up in this beautiful fabric. Let me see if I can open it up. It just arrived today and I'm so excited to show you guys. And I just love the little tag on top because it says my name. Let me see if I can open this. So this was the bento box. Um, I'm not sure what month this was. I bought it before I did my big um, stationery haul of the year. So I know I said I wasn't going to purchase any more stationery for this year. But this one was purchased well before I made that promise to myself. Um, so all the bits and pieces that um, came in the mail this month was from purchases from early January. Oh my goodness, look at this cloth. It's got little stamps all over it, like stamped, rubber stamped um, patterns all over it. So it looks handmade. And then the box and the tag is just so beautiful. I'm loving this so much. I actually have no idea what's inside. I mainly got it because it's this cute bento. I absolutely love this. I really hope that stands inside. I'll also put the link to the description box below. <gasps> oh my goodness! Look how cute this is! This is the most adorable box. Okay. <gasps> We've got... I think these are little washi samples. I love these. Sorry. I'm going to just have to change the focus. Okay, I know that got a little bit darker, but it's going to make you see the the products a lot easier. Can you see that? Oh my goodness, that is so cute. I love this so much. This looks like it's hand designed, like created just for this box. So those look like little washi sample strips, so I'll pop them over there. Um, now what is this? This is so cute. So, it says fridge magnet. Oh, it is a little fridge magnet. So it's like this little pillow. It's got a little magnet on the back. And it's these little um, sushi characters in a little bento box. Oh my goodness, I love this. And then this little sticker guy with a little face on top. So cute! This is, oh my goodness, this is like my favourite box in the world. Oh, oh my goodness, this is actually drawn on with um, Textar that's not actually on there. So little rice crackers. I don't know if they handmade all this, but it, it kind of looks like they have. See the little faces on there? So cute! What else is inside? We've got this beautiful see-through paper, and again, it's that really cool design. And a little, oh, I love this. This all looks so beautiful. I'm gonna move the box away so you can see everything a bit better. As you can see, there's these little sections here. Oh my goodness. So, let's move this box out of the road. I can't wait to see. I hope these two are the stamps. Um, so we've got this beautiful, um, it looks like lined paper. Let me lay it to that focus. Oh, it's not going to focus manually. So you can see it says Black Milk Project on the back there. Oops. Oh my goodness, they're little cards. So this one says, oops, sorry, focus. This one says, rice to meet you. <laughs> this one says, you're the salmon to my rice. Oh, it's a little salmon. It's a little salmon guy. <laughs> and that's a little flying salmon. And they're homemade cards. So cute. Let me put them up there. Okay, so next... We have again a handmade little pouch and inside are these little papers. Oh, 
Oh, I just love this so much. Oh, yay, these are stickers. This is honestly my favourite box so far. Oh, look at these stickers. Okay. So we've got little bento box stickers. Oh, it's so cute. I love this so much. This is absolutely incredible. Okay. Now these two, I'm really hoping they're stamps. Yes! Oh my goodness! That is so cute! I love it! It's a little rubber stamp. I can't wait to use him. And then this little guy looks like this stamp. Yes! And I love that they're on um, bits of timber. Let me show you up close. That is so cool! I am in love with these stamps so much. Thank you so much. That's the end of the box. Um, yeah, it was absolutely worth the purchase. Everything is just so adorable. So this is everything back inside the box. I've just packed it up roughly. <laughs> um, but yeah, I would highly recommend getting this. And I think they have different themes each month. So this was the bento theme. So next is a package from Sticky Kit. And as you can see... It's really colourful in the back here, I absolutely love it. I've just turned the brightness back up just because the sun's going down. Now, Sticky Kit, I actually emailed them after I watched um, Jenna's video. And I absolutely loved this theme. So this is the snail mail thing. I emailed her and she kindly um, sent this to me for free. So I was obsessed with this kit when I saw Gemma do a review on it on her YouTube channel. And they, they sent this for free. So I can't be... I just, I'm just so grateful for this, basically. And I'll show you the washi tapes. These are just so lovely. And I was so excited to get them because I already knew how lovely it was. Um... So I'll show you the notepad really quick first. Oops. Focus. Look how adorable it is. It's snail mail theme. So the little wax seal, the little um, envelope, and the little postage box. I love that so much. She even wrote me a little note. And then these are the four washi tapes that if you get the washi tape, um, the washi tape um, pack. So let me open these for you. Okay, so I've opened them all up. Now let me pop them aside because I want to show you these properly. So I've got my trusty journal here so I don't waste any. Now let me find the ends of these. Now I just really wanted to make a point that I emailed her for this kit. She kindly um, said that she would send me one for free to do a review on my channel. But I was going to do it anyway. So honestly, I would purchase her kit's anyway just because they're absolutely beautiful and I really really love them um, I'm just so thankful that she was able to send me it for free because I'm doing this review for her so I will put the link in the description box below and the best thing about the washi tape kits is that it seems like they get really unique washi tapes um, and they theme them each month as well and like look how thick this washi tape is you get a lot in it it's absolutely incredible how much you get. I was so surprised the quality and the thickness um, of these washi tapes. This one is just absolutely beautiful. I don't know where they, they find these ones, but I'm just obsessed with these. They're just so lovely. So that is the four washi tapes that came in my set. As you can see, there's this beautiful one that looks like postal stamps. There's this really thin one that is, I don't know if you can see, it's shiny and it's got little scissors and little dot lines, so you'd cut along the dotted line. This one here is a little bit different. It's like a little collection and it's got things like this and up and it's got the little umbrella, do not stack, so little things related to um, postage and mail. And then this one here's got floral, um, like little floral prints and also these little pens. I'll show you a close up of them. 
because it's actually, some of them are quite shiny. This one here is quite shiny. I don't know if you can see that, but I absolutely love this. So that is the, um, the sticky kit, washi kit. So if you would like to purchase this, I will put the links in the description box below. Thank you so much for sending this to me. I really, really appreciate it. And I love that there's a little extra in there as well. Thank you so much. So this next one here is actually from Jordan Clark. This um, wasn't sent to me for free. <laughs> this one I purchased online. I just really wanted to show you guys the beautiful way she wraps this. And I really want to keep this sticker, so I'm going to do this delicately. Um, and again, I bought this before the big yearly haul. It just actually took a little while to come into um, my pair box. So she's sending it from America. Um, so it took a little while. But I wanted to show you guys the way she wraps it. So I just thought that she does a really, really great job. Now, the stickers that I got. So firstly, I just want to show you that you could reuse this beautiful um, little... It's, she's actually... These are for free. And they're actually little stickers. And I just thought that was beautiful. And it's got the little um, website on the bottom. I absolutely love that one. Sorry, it's not in focus. It's a little sticker set. So cute. I didn't pay for that one. These are the ones I paid for. So that I think is just the invoice. And then these are the three that I bought. So I'll go through... Oh, did I buy four? Oh, I did. <laughs> so I'll go through them one by one. So this one here um, are the flowers. This next one here I absolutely adore. It's got the glasses. Um, the This one is what I really loved. The envelope little notebook it's just so beautiful I bought two of those and then I was obsessed with these circle ones as well so that is what I bought from Jordan Clark she's got a YouTube channel if you don't already know her and she just makes the most adorable stickers I absolutely love her shop um, and I'll put her links in the description boxes below as well so this one is from Jill from Canada, and I actually thought this was something that I purchased as well and forgot about, um, but it wasn't. She just wrapped it very beautifully. So I'll show you what was inside. So she put this beautiful, um, beautiful, <laughs> she put this piece of cardboard in the back. That's why I thought it was a purchase, but that's the end of the purchases. The rest is from um, subscribers. Now she put this in the back so these wouldn't bend. And there's just the most beautiful craft paper. I love this one so much. I don't know where she got these, these prints from, but they're just absolutely gorgeous. I'm obsessed with them. And I can't wait to start using them throughout my snail mail packages. As well as using them for my um, journaling as well. They're really, really good, um, like sturdy paper. Some of them are a bit shiny and some of them are, are matte. But they're just absolutely gorgeous. So thank you so much for them. I really appreciate it. Um, and I'd love to know where you got them from. Because I just am I'm obsessed with these designs. So also that was in the package was this beautiful flip book. Um, oh my goodness. I didn't realise. Can you open this up? <gasps> Little sticker girls. Oh my goodness. How gorgeous are these? Oh, I love these so much. Let me put them back in. That's so cool. I love this. A little shoe. And it looks like it's just been made out of maybe like a ripped up bag. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. This is absolutely lovely. Got a little letter behind there. I won't take that out in case it's private. And some more goodies. <gasps> this is so cute. That's such a lovely idea. Thank you so much for that. And I really appreciate the papers too. They're gorgeous. Next, I got this beautiful postcard in the mail. So I really wanted to thank you for that. I won't flip it over because it has um, her address on the back. Um, but she said she collected this. And there's also a beautiful stamp as well. Um, so I really, really appreciate it. Thank you.
Alrighty, so the next mail is actually the last mini mail from my mini mail challenge. And this is from Karina from Brazil. And I was so excited when I got this because it was the last one to arrive. And look how adorable it is. Oh my goodness. It's actually an uh, so beautiful. And you can see that I think she's drawn all this on. Um, there's a little note on the back. Um, so I'll pop that up there. Oops, there's actually an address. Let me just open this up on. I'll do a bit of a close up for you so you can see it. How cute. Now let me slip it out this way because I needed to hide the address. <gasps> it's even smaller. So it's this nail inside of this nail and then this nail. <gasps> I could do mini mails all year round. Oh, it's a little, um, <gasps> mini mails. This is so cute. I love this so much. Okay, let's flip it this way because this is the right way up. So, um, we've got these teeny weeny mails here. I want to open these one up first. I think, are they, is there something inside of them? <gasps> yes. Teeny weeny gifts. <laughs> That's so cute. I'll leave that down so I don't break it. Oh, so we've got a little mail tag. Oh, so cute. Oh my goodness. Those are either stickers or little cutouts for me to put in my journal. Um, and then what's in here? Oh, I think this is made out of a tea bag. Oh, it's pressed flowers. That's so lovely. I'm not going to take those out in case I break it, but I think they may be three-leaf clovers. So adorable. B for Brittany. And then mini washi tape samples. I love them. A mini postcard. That's such a lovely idea. Oh, two little mini postcards. So cute. You guys got so creative for this challenge and I just want to remind you I am doing another challenge it was in my last video and um, the challenge was to create something spring themed with a pen pal and then the letters in there so check out my other video if you want to see the next challenge that's currently running but thank you so much I love this I adore this mail so much it is so cute and I love your design. Very, very adorable. Thank you so much for entering. Next is this Pooh Bear envelope, which is so adorable. This is from Suzanne in the Netherlands. Let me take all the goodies out inside. Sorry, the, the sun's going down. That's why the colors are all a bit warped. <gasps> Look how cute this is. So... We've got adorable tea. Oh, these beautiful papers. Oh, I love these prints. These are absolutely gorgeous. We've got a little mini flip book. I'll pop that aside for now. This might be the letter. Oh, no, they're not. They're stamps. Oh, in the cutest envelope. Oh, these are so cute. Oh my goodness, let's just move this aside. Look at these oh, mushrooms! <gasps> little doggy! Oh wow! Oh my goodness, these are so beautiful! Thank you so much! I can't wait to go through each and every one of these. <gasps> You'll be seeing these stamps on most of my mail from now on when I'm doing mail art. Thank you! so much i can't believe how long that took you to did it take you a while to collect these i'd love to know there's some really beautiful stamps in there wow thank you so much and then we've got this adorable flip book beautiful designs oh it's fruit <laughs> a little bear that's really cute oh and you've made it out of the the paper that you gave me maybe this is the letter let me see no more goodies. Oh, some beautiful goodies. Look at these more stamps. 
and beautiful stickers. Oh, I'll put them back inside. Oh, I love that one. That's so cute. I love this little flip book. Very, very adorable. It's giving me a really good idea what I can do with those papers. Next um, are these pearl stickers. Very gorgeous. And the letter. Thank you so much for this. I can't wait to use them. Sorry if you can hear some noise in the background. I am right above the garage. Thank you so much. And the Pooh Bear envelope is gorgeous as well. I love it. Thank you. This next one is from Rhonda from the United States. And I'm going to flip it over to show you the beautiful pattern on the back of this envelope. And also because her address is on the front and I don't want to show that. <laughs> oh, yay. This is so pretty. Okay. So we've got... On the back of that, I'm pretty sure was the letter. And some beautiful paper. Oh, how gorgeous. Cacti paper. And it looks like it's beautifully designed using, um, what's it called? Watercolour, maybe? We've got some peppermint tea. Those who don't believe in magic will never find it. Oh, I love that. There's another quote here that I'll read after. I think it's about friendship. Apple and cranberry tea. Oh, I absolutely love this design. I think that's the letter again. Um, with the beautiful design that she's designed the envelope in. Live a colourful life. <laughs> I'm really liking these quotes. Without the rain, there would never be. Rainbows! <laughs> Are these handmade? They actually look handmade, these little cards. Beautiful washi tape samples. All these beautiful um, cutouts. We've got this little card that you can put on front of an envelope. And lastly, are these little cute cards. That one says, um, cute, cute, and the other one says, I think you are a succulent. <laughs> I love this. This is a beautiful aesthetic. The greens are just absolutely gorgeous and you know I love my cacti so thank you so much. Um, I can't wait to read your letter and drink the beautiful tea that you sent me. Thank you. This next one is from Eccentric Nincompoop, <laughs> um, also from New Zealand. This is from the same person who sent me the Hobbit postcard. Um, I couldn't wait to open this. I love the Totoro so much and that you've made your own envelope. It's absolutely gorgeous. Let's see what's inside. Okay, let me flip this over. Oh, so many goodies. <laughs> okay. Oh, you made your own um, paper clip. I love that. We've got a little tea here. Oh my goodness. She's got an Etsy Instagram and a blog. Let me do a close up in case you want to follow. So, let me just read this little card here. So, this says, um, your very own 35% off coupon. Oh, I love this. For your followers, 15% off. So, let me show you this. So, she's got a coupon code for me. And um, for you guys, that is so kind. I can't wait to check out your Etsy. I advise everyone to go check out the Etsy and use the code BMYouTube for 15% off. Um, I'll put the link in the description box below. I can't wait to see what you've created, so thank you so much for sending me this. Um, and if you guys do check out the Etsy, make sure you write in the comment section um, if you've checked it out, because I'd love to know how many of you guys have um, supported or looked at or um, even checked out her Etsy just to support her. That would be lovely. Let's see what's in here. Alright, so we've got the beautiful letter. I love how creative you are with your painting. Um, let's go through. Let's go, let's put this one aside. And these bookmarks aside and we'll go through this pile first. So you can see, um, beautiful big postcard of New Zealand. That's so lovely, thank you. What are these? Oh, are these cards? 
is a beautiful pattern. Oh, I love this one. Oh my goodness! Oh, you made this! This makes me so happy! I love it so much. So it's a little Totoro with the cactus on top. Thank you so much. I might frame this one um, and pop it on my wall. Love that so much. Thank you. Let's move that one aside. Personalised bookmarks. <gasps> so cute. You're so creative. And then what's in this gorgeous little bundle here? Oh wow, there's so many goodies in here. So we've got another homemade, um, what's it called, paper clip with this gorgeous one up here. And then lots of goodies. So we've got googly eyes and stickers and these life cards. Oh, thank you so much. I can't wait to frame this one. I love how many homemade things there are inside. These beautiful bookmarks. And again, I love that you've written up your own coupon code. So again, if you do check out her Etsy, please let me know in the comments below. I can't wait to frame this one and put it on my wall. Thank you. Alrighty, so this next one is absolutely gorgeous. Again, I love these prints and this washi tape is so beautiful. I don't know who this is from or where it's from yet. Um, but the wrapping is absolutely gorgeous. I love this print here. Oh, it's actually a bag. I just don't want to wreck it. Okay, so we've got the lovely letter here, so I'll pop that up there. Oh, cute little parcels. Alright, we'll go through these parcels separately. Um, I want to see what these are. So this actually looks like it's just some beautiful paper for me to craft with. Wow. Is there anything on the back? So there's white on the back. These are so cute. Thank you. I got nice paper clips as well. We'll pop that up there. Look at this little lady. Ladybug on a little leaf. Oh, did that focus? How cute! I can't wait to put that in my journal. Let me make sure I don't rip it. I actually would love to keep this bag as well. Yes. Yes, I did. Oh, there's some homemade things in here. Alrighty, so what have we got first? So we've got this gorgeous sticker sheet. And it's got um, little succulents all over it. So let's pop that to the side. We've got this airmail ticket. I think it might be a sticker. Oh, and it's shiny. We've also got this airline. Um, I could put that in a... Oh, actually, I'm going to be making a um, travel journal soon. So I can put these two in there. I love that. Pop that to the side. Um, and this looks like a little flip book. So we've got a beautiful fairy on the front. Oh, how cute. Handle with care. Oh, it's like a little mini zine. Oh. And then the most adorable washi samples. <gasps> Travelers Company Japan, the travelerscompany.com. Oh, I love this so much. How gorgeous is that? I'm putting this straight in my journal. Absolutely love it. Thank you so much for that. And then we've got even more goodies here. So let me move these to the side. And they've all got <laughs> the cute stickers on the front. All right. Oh my goodness, there is so much. Okay. Wow, I love everything. Oh my goodness, this is travel themed and floral. These are so beautiful. Oh my goodness, I love that whole bunch there. <laughs> um, next. Yes, more washi tape. Oh, and I think this is the one that's on the front. 
Yes! These are so gorgeous! I love your stationery. I've always said that I'd love to be... Oh, and tea! I'd love to just go inside people's houses and just go through their stationery. I wish there was like... Do you know how there's like an antiques roadshow, how you can search through people's houses? Imagine if there was like a, a stationery roadshow where you could go from house to house and just look through all their stationery. <gasps> oh, these are so cute! Oh my goodness, they're little stickers! I love them! They're all um, transparent stickers. This was such a beautiful package and you'll be seeing me use a lot of this stationery in my upcoming videos. Thank you so much. I really, really appreciate it. This was such a lovely package. Thank you. So this next one is from Lucia from the United States. And it came in a larger package, although that one had the address on. So um, this one was inside of that one, just to let you know how people post things, because you guys get curious. Um, let me actually get my scissors for this. It actually looks like there might be a flip book inside. This is so gorgeous already. I love her nail art on the front. Oops, let me just grab that back. <gasps> wow! Adventure awaits! <laughs> I love it. I can't wait. The string is beautiful. I'm keeping that. I'm reusing that. <laughs> of course, I reuse everything. Alrighty. Oh, this is so beautiful. <gasps> okay, so how do we open this? So, we've got the lovely letter inside of there, and that's in like a see-through plastic bag. Oh, I think it actually opens. How does this open? <gasps> okay. <laughs> Worked it out. <laughs> Let me move that up. So, we've got this beautiful design here. We've got a pocket for the letter. We've got this beautiful... Does this open up or is it designed? I think this is a... Yeah, I think it's um, it's a watercolour cacti and it's actually stuck onto it like a little... I don't think it's a pocket. I think it's stuck on like a little um, art piece. It's even got a little shadow. I love that. And then we've got... What is this actually? Oops. Oh! <laughs> It's a little, um, oh, it's a magnet, so it's a little notepad. Or is it a notepad or is it sticky notes? Yeah, I think it's a little notepad. That's so lovely. Thank you. Oh, and this envelopes. <gasps> Got the most beautiful little stamp on the front. Oh, it's handmade little cutouts. Oh, how beautiful. I think that one is a hummingbird. Oh no, that one's... Oh, the little birds. Okay. And they've got little... Um, what's it called? Little pressed flowers on them. Oh, that's such a lovely idea. That's so creative. Let me put that up there for you. This is another plastic sleeve. Oh, and it's designed with a... Um, tea tab on the front. Let me show you up in close. How lovely is that? I don't want to wreck it. Oh, because it's a tea inside! That's so cool! So the tea, tea tab's on the outside, but there's a tea inside. I love that idea! Okay, let me slide that one back in. And then it folds up like that. Now, is there something on this side as well? Oh, there was! <laughs> I thought I could feel something. So we've got a popsicle stick with the washi tape samples. Ah, and beautiful stationery. Again, I love this bird theme. It's very beautiful. So we've got the writing paper. I think that's wrapping paper. I can make envelopes out of those. Thank you so much. That's such a lovely idea. I like how you made this flip book. It's a lot different to the ones I usually get. How does it flip back up? I think it was this way and I think it flipped that way and then in. Wow! <laughs> Thank you so much for that. There were so many handmade goodies and some great ideas. I can't wait to read your letter. Thank you so much.
So this one arrived today and it arrived from the United States from Piola. And I'll just take off that. I've already cut it open. So it's easy for me to open on camera. Oh wow, there's so much inside of this. It's so colourful. <gasps> there's multiple mini packages. Okay. So this is some beautiful paper. So the chickens and the vegetables. I love that. Can't wait to use those ones. I'm going to have to get a little bit more colourful in my um, snail mail. Oh my goodness. This looks like mini mail. Like our mini mail challenge. So beautiful mini um, pegs there. We've got this bag full of goodies, which I love and I'll open up later. We've got this gorgeous dog paper clip inside this beautiful mini envelope with a mini letter. We've got these other two little mini envelopes. Oh, that is just so cute. Look how many they are. Let me bring it up close. I love them so much. I can't wait to use them. I might put them straight into my journal. This here is mini cards. Oh, actually, what is this? Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. More paper. They're so cute. This is such a cute set. I'm loving all the colours in here. And then this one says, Paper Homegrown by Eco Park. Again, these all these envelopes look handmade. Oh, some more handmade goodies. Oh my goodness, these are beautiful. Thank you so much. I love them. And then I'll move those to the side. And we've got a little flip book. <laughs> Happiness. We've got some beautiful stickers. Oh, cute. And lots of goodie. These tags are just beautiful as well. Oh, I love this. Very, very cute. How colourful and fun is this happy mail? And I love how everything looks handmade. I think everything is handmade, to be honest with you. Little mini envelopes, little mini embellishments that I can put on the front of things. Beautiful mini flip book, some adorable paper clips. Not paper clips, sorry. These are more like pegs. <laughs> Thank you so much for that. I can't wait to read your card. And I love your style. It's absolutely gorgeous. Thank you. Ugly doggly. So lastly, but very not least, it is the beautiful package from Jenna Templeton. Now this is the package that we made together. Well, not together. She made it at her house. I also made one that was um, created using goods that we found from the thrift store. So we both went flip thrift shopping. Sorry, I'm a bit tongue tied. We both went thrift shopping. We both made a package and we sent it to each other. This is the one she created for me. I've been waiting to open this for so long. I'm finally opening it. I'll put the video in the description box below the one that she created. Um, you should go check it out. She did such an amazing job. She put so much effort into it. So let's start with, let's move all this away. And we'll start with this gorgeous, um, it's like pockets full of goodies. So what she's done is she created these beautiful pockets and she's put all these goodies that she cut out from things that she found from the thrift store and I can't wait to use them. This is absolutely gorgeous. Oh my goodness. I saw her making this and I was obsessed and I waited so long to open this package. So this is super exciting. She also made this gift bag for me. And this was from a book that she found at the thrift store. There's also this gorgeous package here. And she did a little tag that says, for you. <laughs> and made this funny looking, I don't even know what this is. It's like a, a medicine capsule. Um, and she put it on hard paper. And she made a postcard. How cool is that? I love her ideas. She's so creative. You should definitely go check out her channel. Oh. This is so cool. So I think these are little cutouts. 
and she found like everything here is from the thrift store so she found this little pocket and put that in some more beautiful cutouts that I can use throughout my crafting oh I love this card some more goodies oh my goodness <gasps> she made an is this an envelope oh that's so cool she made an envelope out of this beautiful wrapping paper I think there might be oh my goodness there's more inside of here oh she did such a good job and a Tom and Jerry card I can't believe you found that oh my goodness okay some more beautiful paper And then there's more paper. And I love this. I could not believe that she gave this to me. I thought she was going to keep it to herself. And I can't wait to put this in my journal. But it's this little um, mouse and he's got mail. And he's going to the postman. I thought that was so cute. And I love it. I can't wait to use it. So this is a DIY botanical letter set. So what she's done is she's created her own... Um, letter set. You can see she created her own envelopes. It's just so gorgeous. And her own writing paper. I love it so much. I don't want to wreck this because I want to keep this all tucked away. And I'm going to use it for a special day. <laughs> and then next, it's even more fun. So she found this from the sewing section. Oh my goodness, she added this adorable planner in for me. Thank you so much. I absolutely love your designs. You did such an amazing job at this video. And I can't wait to put all of this in my journal and use all the goodies that you bought me. Thank you so much. Um, I hope you guys like this video for today. Um, I can't wait to start using all the stationery that I got. Please check out Sticky Kit's website. I'll put the link in the description box below. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.